back, pal, with another video. We're going to be going over AMC, AMC Entertainment Holdings, ticker symbol AMC. This will be a quick video. I'm going to go over you guys. Yes, I did buy AMC today. I'll go over you guys some levels I'm looking at, a key level. I don't want AMC to break. If it does break that level, I'll just cut it and look to play it again. The targets where I'm looking for AMC to go and the resistance levels. So smash that like button. Subscribe if you are new. Thank you guys for being here. If you want to update on AMC tomorrow, all you have to do is get the video over 150 likes. And I'll update you guys on AMC tomorrow. AMC could crash. AMC could explode. So let's get into it. Now, um, we're going to talk about AMC stock. I have an ultimate target of $8, right? But I'm going to bring this target down to about $7.50. So this is my new target I'm aiming for with the current play that I have now on AMC of a swing. As you guys can see here, bought AMC shares right here. That's the price I bought where I'm looking to take the first exit. As you guys know, I like to scale up. And if that price cuts, uh, if it breaks below like $5, I'll just cut it. That's why I say make sure you join the team. You get everything I buy and sell, what I'm looking at, where I'm looking to exit, and all the key levels. I'll also teach you guys how to trade in the market as well. It's that first link in the description. Invest in yourself. Do not worry about the dollar amount. Okay. Now, with that being said, I went on and bought. If price on AMC breaks this buying level right here, right around $5.20, I'll probably cut the AMC shares that I have. Reason being is if it starts to break that level, that means it's starting to lose buying pressure. That means it probably doesn't want to start trending higher. It wants to start going lower and it might have a little bigger pull down, kind of like Mullen or so that you need to be watching out for. Like that video before this one, there's a video on Mullen. Make sure you watch that one because I go over a lot of key things in Mullen. Also have a video on a stock that I want to buy heavy. Two big videos, make sure you watch them. But in that Mullen video, you guys know how Mullen crashed. That's what I don't want to get caught in. I actually sold Mullen right before it crashed too. So I don't want to be holding a bag. I don't care what stock it is. I don't want to be holding a bag. Okay, again, not financial advice. I'm just letting you guys know what I am doing. So I did buy. Now, my first exit will be around $6. My second exit will be around $6.40. So by the time it reaches this resistance level, I am already about half of the play out. I am already taking profit. Now, once it reaches $6, that's already about a 9% gain. I'll probably sell a quarter. Once it hits that resistance level, I'll sell another quarter at about 16%. Now, depending on what happens at that resistance level, let's take this off. Let's take this off as well. Depending on what happens at this resistance level, like say it runs up, do we get a heavy sell-off? If we get that, I'll probably sell the rest of the position because I will not lose on it. So I'll probably just cut profit, and then I'll probably be up on that play maybe around 5 to 7% or so, which is good for me. Any profitable play, I am happy with. Or do we get pushed above this? If we get pushed above that, then I'm going to take it all the way to about $7.50, where that would be about a 35% gain on AMC, right? So it all kind of depends. One, if it comes back down and breaks this level, I will actually cut it. Two, what happens at this resistance level if it does get that secondary push? I just feel like it's at a key area. That's why I did get it. But with stocks like these, you really want to have strong, strong, strong risk management because just as fast as they go to the upside is just as fast they can go to the downside. So that's just kind of an update how I'm looking to play AMC, where I'm looking to exit AMC and the, the, the levels right here because this $5.20 level is a support level and a buying level in one and it almost hit that level perfect. My level I had was right around $5.20. And then if you look at the low today, the low was down here at about $5.27. So only seven cents off. Notice how we had this run here. Let's go down to the five minute chart real quick. Let me zoom in. All right, so notice how we had this run, right? In the beginning, two runs here, it started to pull down. Notice how that pull down didn't break any prices to the lower side. And then it actually started to break up even higher had a little pull down right around power hour. So be mindful of that. I think it's starting to show some strength in the area that it needs to show strength at, which is key. So I'm looking for AMC to go higher. Thank you guys for watching the video. Smash the like button, subscribe. If you guys want that update, watch the two videos for this one on Mullen and the stock that I'm looking to buy heavy and follow me on Instagram, will.knowledge. I have 1,665 followers. Let's run the followers up. Please make sure you're following the right Instagram account. Also, there are fake ones. This is my only one right here. Please make sure it's spelled correctly. And always remember, no recommendation to buy or sell anything just for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in this video. I will catch you guys in that next one. Bye.